Hi, my name is Mark Dudley. I'm the Senior Electronic Engineer for Civicon, and today we're going to be talking about the 3205 onboard monitor. By the end of this video, you should be able to identify the lights and the icons on the 3205 monitor. We have pre-programmed this unit to be a four compartment truck so we can go through the explanation of the lights. These lights right here correspond with the compartments on the trailer. Your truck here will show you different compartments on your trailer as well. So compartment one, compartment two, compartment three, and compartment four. This set of lights here is your permit light. This also will be your retain timer when you're using retain probes. Every eight minutes, one of these lights will disappear until you run out of lights. Once you run out of lights, you will lose your permit. To reset your retain timer, you can either use your finger by placing it over this window, or you can also use the function key that was supplied with the unit by placing it over the same window. The blue light that you see flashing here in this window is just a communication light. This light is normal. This just tells you that the unit is alive and working. Now we're gonna show you what the display looks like when a overfill happens in compartment number two. You lose your green permit indication here, and then down here on your compartment lights, they will all start flashing. Number two will stay solid because that is the compartment in overfill. You can see on your screen that compartment two is now full of liquid. Now we're gonna show you on the display what a broken wire looks like on a compartment. So as you can see down here on your compartment lights, all of them are flashing and number three is on solid red. Up here in your permit indication area, now you see that you have two red flashing indicators. This means that the unit is in an error state. The number three with the up arrow indicates that you have a problem with overfill sensor number three. This icon next to it represents a broken wire. So after fixing your broken wire, you'll notice that you get your green permit indication back, but you still have the icon on the display. To clear this, you can either use the function key that was provided with the unit or your finger, and you just place it over this window. Once you do that, your unit will go back into normal operation mode. If you power up the unit, and you get this icon, the little battery symbol with an X, that means you don't have enough voltage. You need to check your voltage and make sure that you're over 12 volts. So after you get the unit back up to 12 volts, you have to cycle power to clear this error. Once you get your unit back above 12 volts and cycle the power, you see that you have the battery icon with the check mark. Then your unit will go through its standard startup procedure. This would be the icon that you would see after properly installing and programming overfill and retain two wire sensors. We have reprogrammed this unit to be a two compartment unit with retain and overfill. We're gonna show you what a retain would look like on compartment number two. You can see that your compartment light down here lights up green. That shows you that you have retain in that compartment. You can also see it here on the graphic display. You can see here on the permit indicator that the first green light has started a flash. That light will disappear after eight minutes. Each light will then continue to disappear every eight minutes until they're all gone. Once they're all gone, this will shut the unit down to a non-permit condition. So once you get down to the last green light flashing, if you want to reset your timer, you can either put your finger or the function key across this window to reset your timer. We are now gonna show you a broken wire on compartment number two of a retain sensor. You can see that the arrow is now facing down. You still have your compartment number two light and you also have the broken wire icon. You also see here on your compartment lights down below that number two is lit solid. 
You also have the two red lights here in this window stating that you have a retain sensor error. Now you should be able to identify the icons and the lights on the 3205 monitor. For further information on this, please visit our website or give us a call.